In this question, I'm working with the solution to a previous problem, and I'm asked to express this solution in vector form. So I have x1 through x4 in terms of s and t. And to put this into vector form, I'm going to have three vectors, one of constants, one multiplied by s, and one multiplied by t. So first, let's start by pulling out the constants. In x1, I have 3, so that's going to go in the top row. x2 has a 5 in it. And x3 and x4 both only have variables in it. x3 has s, x4 has t. So you can think about that as like s plus 0 and t plus 0. So for this constant vector, I'm just going to get zeros for the second two components. The second vector is going to be the coefficients of s. So in x1, that's negative 1. In x2, that's 2. x3, 1. And x4 doesn't have an s term in it, so I can think about that as like 0s. So that gives me a 0. Now, my third vector is going to be coefficients of t. So for x1, that gives me negative 1 x2, negative 3, and then x3 does not have a product of t in it, it only has an s term, so I can think about that like plus 0t. So that gives me a 0 for the third component. And then x4 has t in it, but just 1, so that gives me 1. And this is my solution expressed in vector form.